man that gives his woman what he can, mm -hmm. provides for his family what he can. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. But that doesn't sound like a man. That sounds like a boy trapped in a man's body because a man doesn't make excuses. We don't we don't do what we can. Well, we do what we want. At? We don't do what we well, can. Where the we do what we want. Excuses at, brother. We do not, brother. We do not do what we can. We do what we want. What well, we are a reflection of God, brother. Mm. A man is a reflection of God. Correct. A man does for his family what he wants. A man puts in real work. A man wakes up. A man wakes up just to serve God and his family, brother. Let me ask you a question, brother. And for you, to, you and for you to die for your family, tie it is a problem. I never thought there would be a day when I would agree with anything that yada of all men has to say. But this just goes to show you that men can elevate. I'm glad that men are having this conversation with men. Because you see, black men have wanted to call themselves traditional men. Meanwhile, they want submissive women who also go 50-50. You're not a traditional man. Your grandfather would never, never be this kind of spineless and self-loathing little boy. Yada was right to tell him he was a boy trapped in a man's body. He was right to tell him that it's not the, the attitude or the behavior of a man to go 50-50 with this woman. Because it's never 50-50. If you go and listen to the rest of this video, Dusty Braids on the right tells Yada that his woman cooks every day. She cleans every day. She doesn't raise her voice to him and all this here. She's taking care of the children. That's not 50-50. That's 98-2. And I guarantee you this man is not coming up with half of the bills. He said he makes $14 a fucking hour. Not cussing be damned. 14 fucking dollars an hour. That's what he's making. And he wants a woman to help be the missing half of his vacant manhood. And he feels entitled to tell another man something about that. He is combative. He is sassy. He's not a man. Yada said it right in the first few seconds. You're not a man. You're a boy trapped in a man's body. What we are dealing with today is arrested development in the vast majority of men of all races. We just happen to be talking about our men and our race right now because that's what I do. I'm going to tell you right now, one thing for certain, two things for sure. I don't give a damn who don't like it. You're not a man if you're broke. A man is to provide. You are less than a man. You are less than a man. Maybe that's why they called you three-fifths. And I oop.